Hey guys, it is me, Happy Star again. Welcome to Last and Earth Survival No Storage series. The rules are very simple. I have to assemble the chopper without storing any loot inside of the chests. And that's why this base does not have a single chest. And at all times, I have to carry all of my loot inside of the inventory. If I die, I will lose everything. And all of the rules aside, today is a monumental day. I have finally unlocked Bunker Alpha. The task is to go to Bunker Alpha. You already know it is the best place in the game to get chopper parts. All I need is just a chopper gas tank, a chopper wheel. Before we go to that bunker alpha, let's get some tickets from these campfires. I cannot store any loot in the chest, but hey, I can store some stuff in the campfires. I don't have any more loot in the base. I cannot craft any more melee weapons. That's all I got. On the bright side, I'm very close to beating the challenge, so I don't have to clear bunker alpha 20 times unless I get extremely unlucky. And now it looks like we have to begin. Now we're all here. Let's start the operation. So let's talk to Jordan. I'll give the command as soon as you open the door. So luckily, you no longer have to have your own alpha key card. That's the password. Thank you very much. The zombie is going to have a free Glock. Thanks. I'm going to get it. We're going to get this alpha card. 47041. 47041. I've already forgotten the password. <laughs> 47041. Let's drag this thing. Let's finalize it. 47041. There we go. The brain works, ladies and gentlemen. Those last two brain cells, <laughs> they remember the password. So, I think I have to clarify some things. There are a lot of chests here. But for the sakes of the challenge, I cannot store anything inside of these lockers. Because I feel that would be cheating. I don't think that would be interesting. So, if I open up a locker here, I have to either get all of the loot with me or delete everything from that locker. And that's it. I'm never going to touch it again. So, perhaps let's pop open this locker. Let's see what we can get here. If I don't need anything, I'll just have to delete the loot from there. Because, yeah, I'm... I'm gonna get this, I'm gonna get that, and pieces of cloth, yeeted, that's it. Let's see what we can get here inside of the second locker, just useless stuff. There is no way I'm going to take that to my inventory. I'm never going to come back here to pick that stuff up. So we have to delete that for the sake of the challenge. And we have five more lockers. Let's do it. Maybe we'll get some tickets. Oh, Lord, this is useless. That is it. My inventory is already full. I don't think I'll do anything else. Let's just go deeper in that bunker alpha and I'll continue looting these lockers a bit later. Stay alert. We don't know what we can face this time. I kind of know what we can face here. I've cleared this place more times than they can count. Okay, they're going to deal with this fast biter. The fast biter is just tanking those bullets. Why would Whenever I fight them, they follow me. Okay, the overseer card required. We still have to save the other dude. Let's open that up. Oh, this time it's going to be a lot easier to clear Bunker Alpha as there will be lots of people helping us. You bring the coupons, you get the rewards. I don't know who invented this dispenser, but it's very convenient. Can we check the trash bin? Okay, these dudes are fighting zombies. That's great. I don't think I have to do anything. They will help me out. I still want to check the trash bin. Sometimes you can get here a ticket, a yellow ticket, a green ticket, and this time we've gotten a green ticket. So I need nine more green. Sadly, you don't get any chopper parts from the green crates. So we need to open up yellow and red crates to get chopper gas tanks and uh, chopper forks. Actually, I just need a chopper gas tank and a chopper wheel. We already have the chopper fork. Anything useful here? More tickets. That's lovely. The elevator leads to the next levels get down to the next floor. Okay, let's go to the second floor. So this is also some sort of a special Bunker Alpha event. So usually Bunker Alpha doesn't look probably like this. Some zombies will be maybe different. Are you sure you want to keep going? I'm personally not sure. So one of the dudes, it's fine. I'm definitely sure. Let's open up the door for them and they're going to deal with all these zombies. I don't have to do anything. We have already leveled up to level 45 on this account because at that level, you unlock your Bunker Alpha. I think before you could go to Bunker Alpha at level 15 or at any level, now you have to level up to level 45. So maybe for beginners it is a little bit more difficult but at the same time i think you will level up to level 45 before you go here okay look at this the dude's just gonna deal with this floater bloater i don't have to do anything we can just wait and that's what i'm planning to do unless i become impatient uh there we go oh no the dude stole my kill i could have gotten some experience watch out the beasts are just waiting to eat us up okay there aren't that many beasts though check this out the door is already open as i said it's a bit different there's a bunch of them in here we should be careful and quiet okay so now this frenzy giant is gonna follow the dude just died from the frenzy giant okay frenzy giant wants to attack me however these guys are gonna start shooting the frenzy giant go and deal with it myself personally i'll just tank everything maybe i'll use a little bit of my glock said glock yet i took my m16 okay, i have to get some more space to be able to dodge this frenzy giant okay let's do here a loop and let's bring this frenzy giant back to them okay go on attack it this at least a few more times here we have a few more shots left and there we go at least we've gotten some points at least we've gotten some experience i do have a lot of useless items like these iron plates and aluminum bars maybe they will be useful someday in the future to progress through the story but i'll have to delete them because i won't have enough space okay we have a lot of other goop that I don't really need. 
Let's delete stuff from this storage. I know in some of these containers, we can get a ticket. So let's search it. Let's get a ticket if I get lucky. Yes, indeed, we've gotten another yellow. We've gotten some more food and nothing really useful inside of this last storage. Wait, I am a little bit curious. Can I go up there and can I loot these rooms? No, the door is stuck. Okay, usually there you can get some more zombies, but apparently not this time. So will I even get enough green tickets to at least open up one green crate? Would be nice to open up a yellow crate, though. That's what I want. Okay, so they're gonna start attacking me. Let's deal with the fast biter. So probably it'll take us quite a while to get enough of those yellow tickets. But we also always have that farm location. I thought it'll be a fun challenge. Okay, the dude's gonna try to fight the big one here. The, they're gonna do that. He thought he knew how to defeat the big one. Well, yes, he was wrong. So yeah, I think it's a fun challenge to clear Bunker Alpha on this account. Careful, the start will kill you if you don't break it quicker. Um, you don't really have to attack that turret. You can just sneak just as you saw me do it here. I'm gonna get my Glock because I'll definitely have to do it again. How much health does this turret have? Okay, the turret's broken. It's not broken though. It is going to start shooting this dude again. There we go. Let's deal with that turret because I already know what's going to happen here. So I was ready. I pulled out that Glock. We have a bolt that I don't really need. And we have one more chest that we could loot. So I usually don't kill that turret. I don't think you have to destroy it as the loot inside of the chest and the turret isn't really worth it. I mean, we did get a green a yellow ticket. That's something. Do we have any yellow tickets in our inbox? We have 10 ration coupons. That is awesome. That means we can already open up a green crate, which is great. But I just don't have space to store all of the loot from the green crate. So if this armor breaks, I'll get another one. And that's it. Okay, let's get a crowbar. So this dude attacked these toxic spitters and yet all these toxic spitters come after me. Kind of unfair if you ask me. All right, we have a few more toxic spitters. Spitters. Perhaps they'll drop us something nice. Okay, more green. Obviously, I cannot open up this room. And maybe instead of using jerky, how about we use bandages? There we go. Kind of don't want to use up all of my healing items. Okay, let's open up this door and let's sneak attack some of these fast biters before they attack them. There we go. That was nice. I already mentioned that a few times during the previous episodes, but it's really fun to play in this account, mainly because I don't have to sort out my inventory. I have all the things here with me and that's it. I don't have to store anything inside of the base. It's also a lot more fun to loot items because every time you loot something... Oh no, the dude died. Yikes. Every time you loot something, you appreciate that loot a bit more. This account definitely has its own advantages. So I'm glad that we are doing this challenge. Okay, so we have to clear the storeroom. There's only one zombie. Usually there are two of them. How about I sneak attack this guy? Let's get a crowbar. Let's try to break it fully. So my goal is try to break the lowest durability weapons first. That way I'll have more space in my inventory. There we go. We dealt with this toxic abomination. We've gotten three more green tickets. We are 22 green tickets. That's amazing. There we go. We saved this guy. And we have to talk to Jordan now. We lost almost everyone. We have to leave. Okay, we've got an A perk. Let's get this gluten perk. I think we can work together. I doubt it. This is the biggest scammer in the game. Skedaddle from here. I never want to see you again. <laughs> Go away from here. So now our goal is to return back to the lobby. We're going to do this. So before I do this, how about I deal with a few more zombies? There are a few more fast biters. Probably there will be a friends giant. How about I just get this Glock and this M16, right? Let's sort of break it. Okay, we have a lot of a lot of zombies here. I know we are using some guns here and there, but hey, what are we going to do with it? I need to get some more space. Plus, we're going to get more stuff from green and yellow tickets. And I'm never going to be able to store that stuff in the base. So I'll never be able to accumulate that stuff. So what's the point to save guns here? I'll have to use them. I'll have to replenish them anyways. And that's why this account is also fun. You have to use items because you cannot hoard anything. I think it's a definitely fun little challenge. And if you have any other ideas for future challenges that you'd love to see on this channel, then hey, let me know that in the comments down below. And also, if you're enjoying these series, smash that like button on the video. Thanks for all of your support. You are amazing. And I think we are done with this second floor. Yep, there's nothing here and the door is stuck. So we can go to the third floor, but I'm not really sure if the third floor is available right now. Maybe it is. Let's go to the first floor anyways. You help me out big time. Now it's my turn. I'll give you some advice on how this works. I'm not quite sure how this thing still works, but having a couple of coupons will help you score big time. You can find a bunch of them lying around in the bunker. Understandable. So, hey, you helped me. You saved me and I'm going to help you as well. So I'm not really sure how this place works, but you get coupons. Thanks, dude. Thanks for nothing. This place is where you get the goods, but to access it, you'll need a fingerprint. Where you get it, it's not my business. What is your business then? I'm, I'm telling you, this guy's the scammer. Since the very beginning, this dude is a scammer. This is his way of repaying us, of helping us. Like the, 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 This is ridiculous. This scammer is absolutely ridiculous. The dude is in his office. And yeah, thanks. I suppose it all went wrong. We are lucky we survived this mess. 
Okay, we got to talk to the specialist. That would be all for now. And yeah, thanks again. I won't forget something like that. I can modify your weapon. That's my job was. Okay, thanks specialist. I guess for nothing. There's nothing we can do with this guy. We have to open the crate from the conveyor. We got 22 tickets. Let's try to open it up. Yeah, I think let's do it. That was the task. Let's open up one crate. And now we have to go home. What's our task? And now we have to go home. What's our task? We have to assemble the chopper. We've gotten another chopper wheel. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the chopper's almost ready. All we need is just a gas tank. Thanks for the free wheel game. Thanks for the free wheel. All I need is just a chopper gas tank. And that's it. Ladies and gentlemen, we are progressing like crazy. The, the challenge is almost over. I can't believe that. But that's amazing. We've gotten another gun, some more healing items. I'll definitely have to come back and get them. It's not like I'm storing anything inside of the chest. I'm just gonna like take out loot from this chest and that's it. I just wanted to delete everything from the top lockers because it feels weird when there's something inside of those lockers. I've gotten a lot of comments from you guys. Okay, now we can go to the third floor. Let's go to that third floor. And I've gotten a lot of comments from you guys saying that maybe I should store some stuff inside of those lockers in Bunker Alpha, but I feel like that would make this challenge a little bit too easy. And at the same time, I really enjoy not sorting out my base. I really enjoy not worrying about loot. That's like the biggest motivation for me to even play in this account. So if I have to go and store more loot inside of those lockers at Bunker Alpha, it it becomes kind of boring then at that point why not just build chests in my base and why are we even doing this challenge in the first place i guess that makes perfect sense let's get a crowbar and let's do this third floor we are at nine yellow tickets we need 25 perhaps today is the day when i'll get that chopper gas maybe today we'll finish this account i have no idea that will be absolutely ridiculous. I'll flip out. That will be absolutely amazing. We could have wall tricked here and there, but it doesn't really matter. I'm not really too obsessed with wall trick. If you want to know how to clear this place efficiently, make sure to check out my free-to-play playlist. Link is down in the description. There, I explain everything on what you need to know about Bunker Alpha, about last generate survival. I share all of my tips and tricks. I'm not even sure if we can get enough yellow tickets. We're at nine so far. Maybe we can do this. I don't know. Let's sneak attack this guy. Let's get our shovel. We could wall trick here and there, but as I said, I need to use up my items. And again, wall tricking would save some healing items here, but I don't think it really matters. It's fine. Sometimes we wall trick, sometimes we don't. Like, for example, here, this room, I think it's better to wall trick this room because there will be a bunch of zombies attacking us at the same time. We've gotten some managers here from this storage, and here we'll have a Frank's Giant. How about we heal up? And let's definitely wall trick this Frank's Giant. We could wall trick it here. It is... Oh, wow! I'm gonna get hit in the face. You know what? Let's just slur it a bit closer. <laughs> let's do it on an easier wall. And there we go. That's how you wall trick in this game. If you cannot wall trick, you can always use your guns. But you will get less guns than just by wall tricking. So try to wall trick. If you cannot wall trick, try to learn how to wall trick. Keep practicing. And my melee weapons are about to break. Hopefully, I have some more melee weapons inside of my inbox. Okay, let's whip out our scythe here for this zombie. Just like that. Let's get the shovel. The shovel is about to break and that's it. I got no more melee weapons. So we could use guns on this account as well. That's not that big of a deal as we are going to open up a yellow crate soon. So we're going to get two more guns. Plus we have some more guns in the inbox. So we have to kind of use them because what else are we going to do with that? Plus we still have katanas. So let's get the katanas. The shovel is almost broken and let's get this thing and let's sneak attack the French giant. I think we can sneak attack it somehow, some way like that. Oh, no, I'm going to get hit in the face. Or maybe I won't get hit in the face. There we go. Let's probably whip out the Glock because by the time this dude reaches the wall, I can just kill it here with the Glock and that's it. As I said, we have to use the weapons anyways as I won't have enough space to store them. There will be a bunch of zombies. Let's kill a few of them with this Glock and then let's break the shovel fully. There we go. The shovel's broken and let's start using this katana. Plus, my armor is about to break so we could go back to the top. We can get that another armor set from the green crate. We are gonna do that very soon, but before we do that, let's probably break this armor first. And let's break a few zombies as well. And yellow tickets are usually tough to come by. Sometimes it's easier to get red tickets than yellow tickets. Hopefully it's not the case today because I want to open up my yellow crate today. That'd be absolutely amazing. Okay, both of them are dead and we've gotten another red. Thanks for the red, but I prefer the yellow. I want a yellow crate. Let's try to sneak attack this phrase giant. Will that work? That did work, ladies and gentlemen. We can whip out our Glock. And we can put this big guy to sleep. I cannot believe that our challenge is almost over. That's it. All I have to do is just clear Bunker Alpha a few more times. Perhaps even a yellow crate will suffice. If that doesn't work, we can keep clearing the farm location until I get that gas tank. And that's it. Okay, we've just leveled up. Let's see. Anything useful? Nope. 
no extra pocket. Extra pocket on this account would be very, 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 very awesome. Wall tricking with the katana is so fast, so easy. When these zombies don't have any armor, I'm loving it. We've gotten another yellow and another green. We are 13 yellow. We need 12 more yellow and that's it. Basically, we're at 50% there. Why am I so happy? There's no way we'll get 12 more yellow. All right, let's keep hoping. My katana is just broken. Let's get another one. We have a lot of guns here, dude. We're gonna blast them. We have to do something with them anyways. <laughs> let's just use them here in this account. This account feels stronger than my free-to-play account because on the free-to-play free account, every time I have to use a Glock, I'm like, ah, I could save it. Here, there's nothing to save here. I'm loving it. Okay, will I be able to sneak attack it? Yep, that worked. And we've gotten another yellow ticket. 16 yellow. So we've killed a few more French Giants. We have gotten 18 yellow tickets. We have 9 red. And to be honest, I just kind of realized that getting red tickets is probably easier than yellow ones. Because you can always get 10 red tickets from the blind one. There is no blind one that gives us yellow tickets. So here, all I have to do is just get 20 red and that's it. Then I'll be able to open up a red crate because we are going to kill the blind one. Okay, my armor will get broken very soon. So I bet I blast this Glock on these toxic bombs and toxic spitters and whatever. Yes, another yellow. 19 yellow, baby. We just need six more yellow. Please, please, please. I can get them. We've just gotten another yellow ticket from another crate. So we are at 20 yellow. We just need five more yellow and that is it. Oh no, I messed that stuff up and my armor is broken. That's not cool at all. We need to get another set of armor. We're going to get it from another crate. Another yellow, baby. 21 yellow tickets. I wish I had another yellow in my inbox. That'd be so cool. I don't have a single yellow coupon here. There we go. I have you no know, double checked that inbox. 22 yellow, baby. We've gotten another yellow ticket from that toxic abomination. Maybe we can get a yellow from this toxic spitter. Uh, just a green. Before we kill more zombies, let's go back to the first floor and let's open up that green crate. Oh, wow. These zombies appeared out of nowhere. What happened? I had like only 19 health. Almost died. All right. At least we've gotten two more green. I don't think I need that stuff. Okay, so some of these zombies have respawned. Uh, whatever. I did not sign up for that, but I guess thanks for nothing. Let's get this other armor. Let's get some more food. Let's get this and uh, whatever. I'm going to keep that baseball bat for later. Let's deal with one more fast biter. Perhaps another coupon. There we go. We've gotten another green. So we have gotten a lot of green tickets here. I did use a lot of healing items on this bunker alpha we had a stack of bandages i used up 16 bandages or something maybe more 20 bandages because i did find some more bandages we have this frenzy giant how about i get this scythe and let's try to sneak attack it that should work there we go worked perfectly let's whip out the glock and let's deal with this schmuck go on please a yellow i know we could get red but uh whatever thanks for the red can't complain about red tickets as well let's get this perk and here we have a room with a lot of toxic spitters I think I'll just deal with them. They might perhaps drop a yellow ticket. Sometimes they do. There we go. We had a Glock. I used it. And we've got a bunch of green and not a single yellow. We just need three more yellow, ladies and gentlemen. Three more yellow. If this game doesn't give me three more yellow tickets, that's a crime. Okay, we have a few more rooms. We could clear another room up there. Maybe that's what I'll do. Perhaps, perhaps. I don't even know why I started blasting guns. I'm not gonna lie. I am expecting a chopper gas tank from that yellow crate. My disappointment would be measurable if I don't get it. That's all I have to say. <laughs> My hopes and dreams will be crushed, but I really have high hopes on that yellow crate. There we go. Another yellow. 23 yellow, baby. We just need two more yellow. I'm pretty sure we can clear that huge room. And that room will have a few yellow coupons. Unless I'm very unlucky. I think we've cleared everything besides this big room. Usually I just avoid it, but I want to clear it today. Let's open it up. Let's sneak attack this toxic abomination with the saw blade mace. And let's just dip out of here. I should have gotten a Glock instead of this Katana. That was stupid of me, but I, whatever. Let's go through here, through here. I'm gonna heal up and I'll just hide behind this room. And there we go. Let's start wall tricking them with this M16 just at least a bit to thin out the crowd. Okay, we only have one more Toxic Abomination left. Let's deal with it. And we were able to clear this room let it relatively cheaply. A red, yellow, one more yellow, baby. One more yellow, we did it. Even more than enough. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's open up that yellow crate and go on. Wait, before we do this, we have one more room to clear there. And we're at 11 red. There's no way I'll get enough red today. I just need nine more red and then I can kill the blind one. So we didn't get really anything useful inside of this crate. But anything useful, I mean, we didn't get any more red or yellow tickets or any guns. And a crowbar, whatever. I'll get that crowbar. We do have some more space. And check this out. Our inventory yeah, got a little bit thinner. Now, all I want is just a chopper gasting inside of that yellow crate. It'll be ridiculous. We'll have our chopper. That'll be amazing. But I, I don't know. Now my expectations have dropped. 
when I didn't have those yellow tickets, I thought, hey, I have an 80% chance of getting it. And I'm like, eh, maybe we have like a 10% chance of getting the chopper gas tank today. Please, please, pretty please, 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 please. No, no. Disappointment is immeasurable. My day's been ruined. That's all I have to say. Now we have to find a way to bring these items back to the base. By back to the base, I mean to my backpack. Well, that's all I was able to take. I dropped this other armor here. I don't really care about it. I probably shouldn't bother about these plastics. I should just leave them behind, but whatever. It's not like we got anything better to take. Now let's loot the rest of these crates and maybe let's hop to the farm location. It should be very quick. Let's see if we can get a chopper gas tank there. We didn't really get anything useful here. We've just gotten one canister of fuel. Then we've gotten some bolts and other stuff that I have to delete. There goes some more useless things. And we got two more lockers left. Inside of this locker, we have gotten more bandages. I'll take that plus some more fuel. I don't even know why we need that fuel. I'm still not sure. Maybe we will continue these series on this account as well. Maybe we'll continue assembling something else. Okay, we have to get that Glock and delete the rest of the stuff. I will get that Glock instead of... I don't know what to delete. Instead of 13 plastics, where will I use them? That's it. Let's delete those plastics and let's get the Glock. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. And now, welcome to the farm location. We have already cleared it plenty of time, so I'll try to clear it as fast as possible. And if this is not the last episode in these series, then probably the next episode will be the last one. As all I have to do is just get a chopper gas tank unless i'll have to clear 50 more farm locations and 50 more bunker alphas which is totally possible okay we've just leveled up anything useful and uh, nope we've got in this careful park let's put this revenger to sleep real quick i still haven't found the key i've already opened up like two or three chests and i still don't have the barn key and i am pretty sure i'm like 99.9% .9 sure that here we're gonna get that key because I've already opened up all of the other crates. There we go. We've gotten that key. Thank you very much, crate. And hey, go on, please. Pretty please. Let's open it up. And let's see if I can get those chopper parts. Please. Maybe I'll assemble my chopper. A gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank. <gasps> oh, I can't believe this. Wait, we need to double check. Wait. Is that a mirage? We did it. So I have some good and bad news, ladies and gentlemen. The good news is... We have a gas tank. The bad news, and I'm kind of sad that the this account is almost over, probably. We did it. We've beaten everything, ladies and gentlemen. We have the chopper. We have it. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the chopper. I still want to open up the blue crate because if we continue in this account, I won't mind having more loot, ladies and gentlemen. Right, this armor is almost at full durability, so I don't think I need another armor. What I do need is healing items and melee weapons. I don't think I need anything else. Let's read this, this this the copper anything else that i could take i don't think so yeah i don't think there's anything else i could have taken from that place ladies and gentlemen let's finish the chopper let's drop the gas tank for a second i couldn't find it i panicked i thought we don't have the gas tank now let's get that free wheel that we've gotten there we go ladies and gentlemen and let's assemble the chopper that is it ladies and gentlemen we did it we totally did it let's finalize that we have it. That's it. We have assembled the chopper. I haven't really tried even hard in this account. We haven't built a single chest here. It is ridiculously easy to assemble your chopper now. Back in the days, you had to play this game for half a year. Those chopper gas tanks were extremely rare. You could only get them from the red crates. Then they added those gas tanks to yellow crates. Now we can also get them at the farm location. The farm location is easier than ever. So if you still don't have your chopper, I am sure you're going to get it because if I was able to get it here on this account, obviously I got a little bit lucky because I got it pretty fast, but I'm still pretty sure you can get your chopper. So hey, it's been a fun ride. If you have any other ideas on what we could do on this account, please let me know in the comments down below. But for now, the challenge is over. Perhaps we'll start something else. And a hide suggestion check out my scum survival let's player click here on the second card and look at my days gone let's player hop over to my channel go to playlist and there you'll find a lot of other games that i've played here on the channel if you're not subscribed yet definitely make sure to jump subscribe button and notification bell to not miss any future videos and see you in the next one